I am the um, Recovery Support Program Manager at Duffy Health Center. We are a federally qualified health center right on Main Street in Hyannis. Um, we primarily serve individuals experiencing homelessness or at risk of homelessness. Um, we offer primary care, behavioral health, case management, um, and substance use disorder services. Our mobile unit, which is right behind me, is sort of a response to Cape Cod in general. So what we find when people are trying to access healthcare or treatment is that transportation on the Cape is incredibly difficult and it's a barrier to care um, in all aspects of the continuum. So we wanted to be able to bring our services at Duffy, which are wraparound sort of whole health, what people need um, to the whole Cape. So um, we were able to purchase the unit um, on the unit, there is a recovery coach, so recovery support staff that can link folks to treatment services, community support, harm reduction supplies, so whether that be Narcan or getting folks over to Aid Support Group of Cape Cod or any other local harm reduction site for safe use supplies, testing, really looking at that harm reduction approach. There's a case manager that can work on housing for our unhoused population, can look at sort of general barriers. So what we find is, and what I think people don't really know until they peel back the onion, is that being unhoused isn't just about being unhoused, like getting to that next step, um, like having an ID. You need an ID and a social security card to fill out housing paperwork. But if you're living outside and you don't know where your backpack is and someone takes your backpack, you don't have that ID and it just starts a whole. Um, and also, gaining employment or getting housing, um, being able to take a shower. One of the big things we found is giving folks access to basic needs, which is really what this unit, um, the pillar of it is, is there's a full shower on it. There's a full place to meet with individuals, do treatment intakes, all that stuff. We have a basic need supplies, so clothing, clean clothing, fresh clothes, things like that. So if we're meeting individuals' basic needs, then we can look at those bigger concepts like housing, employment, um, being a, like engaging in the community in an appropriate way, all those things. Um, but we need folks' basic needs to be met first. And so it's really all about human connection. We really just want to um, want to bond with folks and like foster a trusting atmosphere. So then people are willing to let us help them with that bigger stuff. So really being a part of the community, being accepted by the community um, is what the unit's about. On Monday mornings, we are over in Yarmouth at Yarmouth Comprehensive Treatment Center, which is our local methadone clinic. Um, it's a great place to meet people as they're getting their dose and maybe going to work and don't have a place to shower before work. Um, we've been able to offer a lot of people primary care services there, so getting enrolled with Duffy, who didn't previously have that link to healthcare. Um, after the Comprehensive Treatment Center on Monday morning, we are at Dennis Union Church and then also at the um, Dennis Free Public Library. Uh, so that's a full day of Dennis and Yarmouth really working in that community. On Tuesdays, we're in Falmouth and we partner with St. Barnabas Church, who does a lunch um, for community members that day, where Housing Assistance Corporation and VinFen are there. Um, so our unit is at St. Barnabas Church offering showers um, and offering those supportive services that I talked about. On Wednesday, we are here in Barnstable proper. Right now, we're at um, the Hyannis Public Library. They've been an unbelievable partner. They're doing a lot of work for our community members, um, that especially the ones that are unhoused. So they have um, a food program going on where they have grab-and-go sandwiches inside. They provide us with books for individuals. Um, we hope to beef this up as the summer com comes on and move um, to different locations in Hyannis, but that's to come. Um, and then on Fridays, we do a full day in Mashpee. Um, so we go to the Wendy's in Mashpee. They've been wonderful letting us be right in that front parking lot. We go to the Mashpee Public Library, um, and we also go to One Shared Spirit, which is a um, peer drop-in. They're also a harm reduction site. They offer Narcan um, and SSP services, and they do a lot of supportive work um, with the Mashpee community in terms of substance use disorder. So that's our schedule for right now. We are obviously hoping to continue to grow and expand. Um, we 
have served a lot of people so far. So I think our job now, especially as the weather gets warm, is to really um, get our staff out there, find some new locations, and really um, be where people need us.